Hey buddies, so that's guy here. Hope you're having an awesome day so far. In this video, we're going to show you how to install the Beppin X Configuration Manager. This is essentially an in-game console that will allow you to manage and configure all of your Beppin X plugins or mods that you're adding to Valheim. Um, and it's a much easier way to do it because you can do it via an in-game console as opposed to the config files. Alrighty. So to install the configuration manager, you'll need to go to this link here. I'll put the link in the description below for you for your ease. Now the Beppin X configuration manager uh, can be downloaded right here. This is the download right here. This Beppin X dot configuration manager version 16.1 dot zip. So we're going to download that and we're going to put a special folder, just a random doesn't matter what folder it is. We're just going to use that to extract it in. Uh, we're going to extract this zip folder here and you can then go into Bepinex plugins and this you see Bepinex plugins and that's going to relate to the Bepinex and plugins folders within your Valheim uh, files. So if you want to go to there, you go to Valheim files, you go to manage, browse local files, Valheim, Bepinex plugins. You see that Bepinex plugins? Bepinex plugins, and you're essentially just going to drag and drop these into your Bepinex plugins folder within the Valheim folder itself. And that will have the configuration manager installed. And that's literally all you need to do. It's really easy. Uh, and it's going to make modifying your modifiers, <laughs> manipulating your mods much easier to do. Because normally the method for doing that would be going into the uh, Valheim Bepinex folders, going to then config folder, double clicking one of these, and then manipulating values within here, which is a pain in the butt um, and can't be done in game. Then you need to reload the game and it's a bit of a pain in the butt. So we're going to launch the game and show you what it looks like to show you that it has worked um, so that we are going to do that real quick. And we'll cut to when we've uh, been able to show you that. Alrighty, we've now loaded into our game and we can hit F1 is the key to open up the configuration manager. And hey ho, there we go. Happy days. This is the config manager for mods. Any mods that you had installed, I don't have any uh, put in my mods folder, my plugins folder at the moment, but any plugins or mods that you had installed in the folder would all appear here and would allow you to have their individual specific customizable options customizable from here. Honestly, it makes makes modding a buttload easier. I highly recommend doing it. Um, and of course, as you've just seen, it's really simple to do. Guys, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos like this, consider subscribing. I'm going to be doing all kinds of mod highlights for individual mods, as well as uh, sort of mod genre, like the best farming mods, the best combat mods, um, sort of all thrown into one video, linking to the other smaller videos that you know have more in-depth descriptions of those mods. Basically, I'm going to be talking about mods a lot. So if that's something that you're interested in, definitely hit that subscribe button. And uh, we'll be doing a lot of those videos coming out every single day for the next couple of weeks, probably. I also stream a lot, uh, five days a week at the moment, every day except Monday and Friday, which I take off to do these videos for you guys. And I go live at one o'clock UK time every day, except Monday and Friday on twitch.tv forward slash some nuts guy. It would be a pleasure to see some of you guys. Regardless, I hope you have an awesome day. Take care.